Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video, this time looking at Seesaw CTF, the red team competition, or Seesaw Red. Um, in this video I just want to run through all the tutorial challenges because they're not too difficult, and I can probably pack them into one video without kind of just beating the horse stupid stuff. The Are You Alive challenge is pretty simple, it's essentially a get flag script. <laughs> it's just simply a a bash command that will spit out the flag for you. So if you were to go ahead and copy and paste it into a terminal, hit enter, just as the description says, it says flag, welcome to red, and you can submit that, like, whatever as your flag if you wanted to. Save it as a flag, put together a get flag script if you cared about that stuff, but not too bad. Pretty simple on this one. I'll just bang through this. Hopefully it won't take too long. Screw it, never mind. <laughs> All right. Um, BB-8 is the other one, and that they're referring to BB-8 is one of the few robots that Google can find. Do you know where they hide? And that is a reference to a robots.txt game. Not a game, but it is robots.txt, that thing in the internet, in the world, um, when the robots.txt file at the root of a web server will explain it to Google search engines or other like index internet crawlers, uh, do not visit these pages. However, for Seesaw Red, it was just kind of clever in that it looks like a regular page with a flag on it. So you can copy and paste that, and that would be the flag you'd submit. This is a YouTube link just for BB-8 in Star Wars, and I guess we don't particularly need to see that, but if you wanted to, you could just simply curl this and you could make that a get flag script if you curl tack s this link and then go ahead and grep tack uh, o e o for only and e for extended regular expressions so we can just use the flag format here flag and curly braces and then regular expressions the period and the asterisk to get the flag um, however it's going to interpret these html characters so maybe that's not the best notion to do here, because I don't particularly want to spend the time to cut that up and bash. Meh. Stuff to show. Next is In My Elements, which is a simple one where they have uh, base64 hidden in the page. It says there's a flag somewhere on the page. Can you find it? If you review the source on this page, or even when we looked at the robots.txt file, you could see it when we curled it even. There's this base64 hidden in an HTML comment. That's what these uh, greater than, less than, waka waka, exclamation point stuff is. It's green here noted as an HTML comment. Again, if you wanted to, you could cut this up, uh, use it with curl, base64 decode it. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Just copy and paste, echo this into base64 tag D to decode, new kung fu Kenny. And we could do this with uh, the curl command if we wanted to. And so we could look for things that have that HTML comment in the style there. And we will probably need to use single quotes for that. So we don't have bash literally interpreting, literally, literally interpolating. Wow, okay, I'm not even going to try and finish that sentence. That won't work. It didn't work because I had spaces there and there are no spaces in that. So just go ahead and remove those. And then you'll get, okay, the flag kind of in base64 and we can go ahead and cut out with the delimiter of a hyphen just field one two maybe three in this case yes great pipe that into base64 attack d and then get our flag just like that all in one line simple stuff the next one is called regular expressions in that can you find the flag in one of these files control f may not be enough we're given a zip archive and if we wanted to we can go ahead and download that I know my directory structure is totally not what it's supposed to be right now. <laughs> Burning through these tutorial questions. Take a little bit of time to download. Now that it has downloaded, I can go ahead and unzip it. And there's a lot of text files in there. So let's go check out that directory. Tons of stuff. Well, we don't want to look through all of it. Let's just run strings on everything. And there's a lot of information there. But we can simply grep attack I for flag. And then if you wanted to, that's going to get a whole lot of results. So use the flag format with the curly brace in there, and then we can get a hit, just a regular flag. Submit that, earn points, cool stuff. Jets, that's the simple stuff for the tutorial challenge. Um, haven't used strings before? Do that. Use a wildcard to hit everything in the current directory, and then grep through that output, look for the flag that you want. Robots.txt is a thing. Base64, do stuff with curl, etc. Simple, simple stuff. Uh, that's the tutorial section in Seesaw Red. So, thanks for watching.
Quick shout out to the people that support me on Patreon. Thank you guys so much. You are phenomenal. And the reason that I keep making these awesome videos, they're not awesome. I, the, vid the videos aren't awesome. They, they probably suck, but you guys are awesome. You awesome people are the reason I keep making these shitty videos. <laughs> All right. Hey, $1 a month on Patreon will give you a special shout out just like this at the end of your video. I can't do please sub anymore because this guy, please sub, Patreon supported me with the name please sub. Uh, so now what do I have to, now I have to type out literally please subscribe every time. Okay. $1 a month gives you a special shout out just like this at the end of every video. And I do a stupid bit every time I have to do this. So it's probably super annoying. Uh, $5 a month on Patreon will give you early access to every video that I record and put on YouTube before it goes live. Because I like to record in bulk and like release things gradually, but I haven't been very good at it lately. <laughs> um, hope you guys are okay with that. Whatever. I'm a, I'm a human being too. I put my pants on the same way you do. Hopefully. <laughs> I gotta end this video right here. If you guys like this video, please do like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, join our Discord server. It's a cool community full of CTO players, programmers, and hackers. Link in the description. Uh, hang out with me, other cool people. We're gonna be playing games like Seesaw Red, obviously. Um, same thing with Pico CTF, if that's coming, and every anything that comes on down the pipe. So, great. Hope to see you guys on Patreon. Hope to see you in the next video. Love ya. Bye.